Florida. Daniel Coco at second. Trey Matthews at first, and Josh Strickland up to bat with two outs. Pitch is going to be inside. That ball is going to get down in the gap. Coco is going to score. Trey Matthews rounds second, now rounding third. Coach Sykes sends him home. Run will score, and that is going to be a stand-up double for second baseman Josh Strickland. Good piece of hitting right there from the second baseman. Driving in two more runs, making it 13 to four. Closing that gap. Take time like that, I might think off speed. So you off speed? <sighs> I'm gonna go fast. All right, we'll see fastball here. Drain, fires a fastball, rip down the line. Maybe if it's over left field. Ooh. And uh, it's down, and how about that? Strickland's gonna have a stand up double here. And how about that? The Royals answer the Cavaliers three to three to score, Don. Fastball, you called it. Drayton kicks and deals, fires a fastball, and right through the gap. That's going to be a scored run for Josh Strickland. And Fick is going to hold up at third, and Baylog will score for the Royals. Five to three, now the score for the Warner Royals, Dalton. Pitch. This one hit through the six hole. It's an RBI single. One run will score. Two runs will score. And now Warner cuts the deficit to 19 to four. In the top of the first. Stricker lines went into left field for the Royals' first base hit of the second game. So Strickland finds some open grass again in the Royal lead. I wouldn't be surprised if he picked. Strickland pops it up in the shallow left field. Left fielder Torres making chase towards the ball, but unable to get there in time as it drops in for. Run one of those plays where you try to steal and cause a rundown as Fickus does take off and Josh Strickland possibly a hit and run placing that ball perfectly down the first baseline and Fickus trying to go from first to third sliding in safely able to avoid the tag nice conversation with you yes sir a nice little dialogue as we like to call it and Strickland with the 0-2 hit right there great piece of hitting fought off two pitches with 0-2 got it right through the six hole as a pitcher giving Josh. 
third baseman, Josh Strickland. And now almost anything here can score the, any ball in play can score the runner. As that is popped up behind shortstop. Shallow, be a tough play. Tough play as that and drops for a base hit. Fitches will score on that pop fly for a base hit all nine tonight. But if not, we'll ha we would have had a great start from Bean. That ball is hit to right, the right side of the field for a base knock. Josh Strickland able to get a base hit. Taylor Bridge comes around the score as Fitches reads the ball off the first baseman's mitt. Played a seven inning game earlier against St. Francis. Like I said, they did take the win there, nine to one. As that's gonna be over the first base, may score. Fick is gonna come around third. Jeffrey Sykes says go home and he will. And that's gonna be an RBI there by Josh Strick. Get out there. There he goes. He gets As the he's first one for one, game. yeah. And he gets the run. Is that swept up the middle? That'll score another run here for the Royals. They're on fire. Great start for the Royals here. That'll be the third hit. And just the first hit. Is that's gonna be up the middle here. And Strickland's gonna record, maybe hit his tough. He play. does get the first base in time. It was an RBI. And it's once again out of play, so Strickland is going to be one in the nation for most triple hit. As that ball is going to be in right field, Strickland most likely run. will do his job. Oh, the ball drops. And it stays fair. As Strickland's going to round second, he's going to go to third. He'll have a triple here. That's the third triple this game for the Royals. Triple. 